In this video, I'll be reviewing three good websites to find some datasets. The first is data.gov. This is an open source data website hosted by the U.S. government. You can browse datasets by category. I'm going to go for health. From there, I'll go to data, and it will give me a list of all of the datasets that are available as well as the formats that I'm able to access them in. If I'm looking for something in particular, I can search the datasets. And it will return me all of the titles that match. If you're interested in data outside of the US, you might try data.gov.uk. This is a similar environment except that the data comes from the United Kingdom's government instead of the United States. You can browse data by theme or go to the data tab and to datasets to begin looking at datasets immediately. Again, it gives you the title of the dataset as well as the formats that you're able to access it in. The last website I'll be showing you is the World Health Organization. I'm showing you the WHO to illustrate that some data sites have a large variety of data on a singular topic. In the case of WHO, it is World Health. To travel there, go to who.int forward slash en for English. This one is a little bit more difficult to navigate. From the splash page, go to data and scroll to the bottom. Here you'll find data repository. Now you'll be able to search for data by theme, category, indicator, and country. I find that category is typically the easiest to find what I'm looking for. In this section, they have in alphabetical order the different categories of data sets that they possess. You can find one that you're looking for, and it will give the subsections. So in this case, under child health, there is the data set for infant nutrition. It will give you a graph of the data set, as well as options for downloading the data sets in the number of formats. There are a great many other places to find data, but these are some of the most reputable and reliable sources.